Hi, my name's Charlie and I'm the lead educator for Curl Smith. Today's video is all about product application and styling techniques. When styling the hair, there are a few important things that you need to consider. Product application and styling method to ensure that you achieve the desired look. When you select your styler, read the label to ensure that you apply the product in the correct way to get the best out of that product. Just open the hair out and spray the product through. Then I'm going to section the hair and use a praying hand method to smooth the leave-in conditioner through. This smooths the hair and ensures that the product is evenly distributed. I've split the hair in half just to be able to control my application. I'm raking the product through each section of hair for even distribution. First of all, we've got finger curling, and this involves taking a section of hair and manipulating it to form a defined curl. You're not working with the natural curl in this styling method, you're forming the curl that you want. This allows you to create the curl size of your desire, and it also defines the curl. However, it can reduce volume. Now that I've finished applying the styler, I'm going to go back through section by section using the pulsing method to enhance the wave and create more volume. Then we have the shingling technique, which is suited to tighter curls and coils. So just work the product through each curl to ensure that the product is evenly distributed and allow the curl to bounce back on itself naturally. This will take quite a bit of time, but the end results are worth it. Next we have the scrunching method and that is where you scrunch the product into the hair to encourage a tighter curl and to enhance your curl pattern. This will shrink the hair, so if you've got a tighter curl pattern, you may not want to use that technique. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel.